They are one of the most valuable assets, our soils, providing nearly 95% of today's food consumed. But the hidden reality across my country, Ghana, and Sub-Saharan Africa is that 65% of our soils are degraded. And with the excessive use of chemical residues in our food production, toxins are laced with our soils, and this, re this, reduces, this reduces or degrades the nutrients or soils that would help produce our foods today. So essentially, it's no doubt commercial farmers lose out on the export market and they are struggling to meet export standards as a result of high chemical residues found, found in produce. To note, there have been 10,000 rejections annually in the last five years, and also Africa is losing a billion dollars in revenue with agricultural export bans towards or from EU markets. I'm Audrey S. Darko, and I'm lead at Sabin Sake. And simply, what we do is to provide soil effect, which is simply an organic soil amendment to commercial horticultural exporters, specifically fruits and vegetables, at 16.6 per 50 kilogram bag. Soil effect doubles as one, a carbon sequestering material, helping to improve organic matter, and two, is fertilizer delivering, essentially enhancing nutrient availability and absorption by the plants and degrading contaminants in the soil over time. We are currently focused on a beachhead target of 100,000 commercial horticultural exporters at the moment, and this is a 6.8% growth rate in that market. And this, we initially focused on them because, one, they've we've discovered that they have a purchasing power to buy and a willingness to pay, and then secondly, they feel the most immediate financial impact as a result of our product being able to reduce the chemical residues in their food produce. So our key value proposition lies in reducing or saving cost and time and increasing revenue. Our product just requires a one-time application during growing seasons, which is between four months to a year, as compared to synthetic, which is applied every two to four weeks. So we have a 55% less input application. And also because we're organic, it helps them, helps reduce the rejection rates um, when they export. But more importantly as well, um, we have, in collaboration with the Center of, of Scientific and Industrial Research, have been able to increase um, yields per he hectare um, 25 to 50%. Our product is our patent pending organic soil amendment, which is derived from agricultural waste. We currently primarily use sugarcane waste and its byproducts, and it follows a three step process whereby we, one, pyrolyze using char technology, two, goes under a fermentation process, and thirdly, it's enhanced further by uniquely identifying our blend of naturally occurring microbes. We further ease access to this and enhance distribution by adopting a decentralized approach where we employ locally um, community members and as well um, fabricators in order to um, improve production, distribution, and marketing. So we are able to build chemical-free soils, regenerate the soils, and also improve a more symbiotic relationship between plants and soils. So we found out that essentially our customers, commercial horticulture exporters, are surrounded by nearly 100% imported expensive chemical fertilizer or inputs and are struggling currently to meet export standards. Ideally, as we capture our 5% beach hair target, we stand at gaining an annual profit of nearly 680,000 euros, and this we would have to achieve by focusing on our key value drivers, ensuring this secured acquisition cost of our material, distribution, and logistics. So our impact on the climate is huge and quick. We are able to reduce the CO2 emissions by 96% per hectare annually, and this is as a result of the technology we're using. And secondly, we are recycling tons of agro waste um, from farming communities and eliminating 53,000 tons of CO2 a year. This is our rock star team. I'm Audrey, a third generation farmer, two years and counting, and I'm excited to be part of the solution. We have our soil scientist, Gabriel, who enables us to test and analyze our soils. Elena helping us with game-changing solutions and has been helping a lot of startups. Um, Eli and Mahmoud on securing material. Essentially, we want to foster a more regenerative economy 
help improve the connectivity between markets, establish multiple amendments across sub-Saharan Africa, and essentially enable farmers to respond to the climate crisis with a more resilient soil. Thank you. <laughs> nice.